to Celebrity Dream Date in sync. We started out with hundreds of girls calling themselves the biggest in sync fans in the world. Now we've narrowed it down to the final five. These girls made it this far as a team, but now they're going against each other for a chance to win a dream date with the hunky boys of in sync over here. Oh, yeah. I'm going to watch myself, Justin. What yeah. do you guys uh, think of our little uh, competition so far? It's great. It's great. So far, so good? Yes. Yes. We're ready. All right, it's time to put the girls in the spotlight. Let's bring out our first semifinalist. She's from right here in Big Bear Lake and has the hots for Hugh Grant. Let's have a round of applause for a local girl. This is Danya. Come here, Danya. How are you? You having fun? I'm having a lot of fun. Is this not one of the most exciting days in your life? You're this close to NSYNC? I don't know. I guess, yeah, of course it is! Yeah? Danya from uh, right here. Local gal. Uh, Joey, you want to ask Danya a question? Yep. What is the most romantic thing a guy's ever done for you? Um, I don't know. My old boyfriend, he rode his bike to my work and gave me roses. Hey. Aww. Aww. That's cute. What's the most romantic thing you've ever done, Joy? I've ever done? Well, it's kind of close to that. Actually, it was uh, my girlfriend's birthday, and she was at work, and I sent a dozen roses every hour for like eight hours for her whole work day i sent roses oh, right. oh, by that time all the people at work were getting sick and tired of it nice i would have liked to see that floors bill donya you can have a seat nice to have you here uh, our next semi-finalist thinks the sexiest thing on a guy is a nice bubble butt this is tanya Tony? how are you tony yeah, nice to have you here. Uh, where are you from? I'm from Big Bear. Oh, you live here too? Okay, good. <laughs> I think Chris has a question for you, Tony, if that's okay. Yes, I have a good question for you. Okay. What is the absolute worst place a guy can take you on the first date? The worst place probably is, like, probably a club where there's lots of music so you don't get to know the guy and, like, just dancing with him, not getting to know him. And yeah. is, is that your final answer? That's my final answer. Thanks, Reed. Would you like to call a friend? All right, thank you very much, Tony. You can have a yep, seat right over there. Well, let's bring out the next uh, semi-finalist. Her favorite actor is Ryan Philippi. <laughs> because he looks like Justin. Here's Amber from Moreno Valley, California. Amber? <laughs> hey, let's scoot over here. Come on, Amber. <laughs> how's, uh, how's your drive from Moreno Valley? How's that, a couple hours? Hundreds of girls, you're down to five. Are you excited? I'm so excited. I want to win so bad. Would you just die if you got to go out with all five of the guys? Yes, I would just die. As would I. Uh, we have a question from Lance. Lance? Okay. What are your three favorite artists and why? NSYNC. Good uh, answer. Brownie <laughs> points. Brownie <laughs> points. <laughs> Christina Aguilera. <laughs> Jessica Simpson. That's good. That's good. All right, we're well, gonna go over there and have a seat. We're gonna do a little trivia around here in just a second. We're meeting the final five right now. That's what's going on here at Big Bear Lake. Our next finalist, she's from West Covina, California. Says the worst thing a guy can do on a date is leave with another girl. This is Belen, everybody. Belen? Nice leap. Belen's doing the 40-yard dash in like 2.2 .2 seconds. Uh, Belen, you're from Moscow, Vina. How's everything going? Do you be excited about the guys we're here? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. I'm very excited. Good. Good for you. Uh, we have a question from JC for you, Belen. Yeah, my question. Hi. Hey, got to ask a question, okay? What is the weirdest thing a guy's ever done for you on a date? Okay, it was actually on my first date, and uh, we went ever? bowling. My first date ever, yes. And we went bowling, and uh, we made a bet, and I was with my brother, my brother had to go, we lost the bet. And we, <laughs> my uh -oh. brother had to go to the grocery store in his underwear, came out with a bottle of cheese Whiz, and I had to eat it in, the whole, in front of the whole grocery store. It was so embarrassing. Oh, that's the most embarrassing thing in the wow, world right there. Where did you come that's up with that? I couldn't eat cheese after. That's weird. If, if Belen wins, is that what the, the date's going to be no. like with you guys? We're going bowling. Cheese Whiz. <laughs> Chock full of cheese Whiz. Len, you can sit right over there. It's nice to have you here at Snow Summit. Let's meet our uh, fifth semifinalist. She's from Chino, California. She likes... This girl likes to mosh at rock shows. Yeah. Wow. Big 
call her star. This is Stephanie. Rock your ass out here, girl. Oh, yeah. Okay. What are we doing? Hey, uh, they call you, they call you star? Yes, they do. Well, why, for short for rock star? Well, I've always liked star since I was a little girl. Superstar. So. Does that pretty good, a little Molly Shannon there. Nice work. Uh, Justin's got a question for you, Star. What's the first thing you notice about a guy? <laughs> she didn't even have to answer with words. Yeah. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Nice Thank charades. you very much. You can step right over there. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like uh, I got to know the girls a little bit better. Now I need to get on to some serious business. It's time to get in sync with in sync. But. I'm gonna need a little help, so we've asked a good friend of ours, someone who knows all the words to tear to my heart in like 20 different languages, from the hit TV show Boy Meets World, Danielle Fischel, everybody. Hey, I was digging that song right yeah, there. Yeah, you are. Danielle, how are you? I'm doing well, how are you? Nice to have you here at uh, Big Bear Lake. Yes, thank you. Are you enjoying your stay? I'm having a wonderful time. What do you hi, think? Boys. Yeah, say hi, boys. Hey, you hello. look a lot taller. Hi. Nice stickers. Huh? In person, you look a lot taller. Do I look a lot taller? It's, it's the shoes. <laughs> Knew it. <laughs> Danielle, you can go right over there. Okay. We're going to get to our, uh, our round here. Here's how this round's going to work. We've got a series of questions based on the dating habits of the guys. Now, the semi-finalists as well as the in-sinker in question, are going to write down their answers. You guys will write them down. You guys will write them down. If you get the question right, Danielle is going to stick them with an instinct, in-sync picture sticker. <laughs> what was that? Please. What did you just say? What did you say? What did you just say? I smell something. Hey, did you say remember when you were on TRL, what hat were you wearing? In-suck. In in-suck, in right? Instinct. It wasn't an instinct. In stuck is worse than instinct. No, it's not. Yes, it is. How could you offend us like that? <laughs> in suck, not instinct. Get it right. Do we, do we want do we want the new single to go to number one on TRL? Oh, whoa. Baby, bye, bye, whoa. bye. bye. <laughs> uh, you guys understand the rules? You'll write down the answer. You guys will write down the answer. Here we go with the first question. If you went on a date with Joey. What kind of flowers would he bring you? You can write down these options. Red roses, white roses, or pink roses. And Joey, you write down the correct answer. Girls? Donya, what's it gonna be? Wanna hold up your answer? Red roses. What'd you say? Tawny? Red, Red roses. roses. Uh -oh. Amber? Pink roses? Elen? <laughs> Red roses? Red roses. Oh! Joey, what's the hair? Well, you know, red is really for love, and if I'm on the first date, it would have to be white means friendship. White roses. Nobody gets a sticker. We'll move on. Sticker on that one. Next card, girls. Uh, what would Chris say is the worst thing a girl can do on a date? Burp, fart, or name drop? <laughs> Chris, write down the correct name answer. Danielle, you want, to, you want to read the answers over there? Danielle, okay. read Donya's okay. answer. Put it up. She said fart. That'd be pretty bad. That's be pretty okay. bad. Amber? Name drop? Name drop? Name drop. Ah. Name drop over Chris? fart? <laughs> oh. The, the diagram's nice, Hey, baby. Too. Hey, baby. You look really good tonight. Thanks a lot. <laughs> All right. Donya and Tawny each have a sticker and are in the lead. Only two girls are going to move on. Let's, let's keep it going here. What's the first thing Justin notices in a girl? Lips, butt, or eyes? Those are your options. Lips, butt, or What's eyes? What's the first thing first, that I the first thing that Justin notices? Danielle, you know the answer to this one too, don't you? Yes, I know this one too. You guys got them all up? You guys Danielle, know? read okay. them down the line. She changed her answer. It's down there. Eyes. She said eyes. Okay, eyes. What? Tina got a big one. What? Amber? Eyes? What? Eyes. Eyes. Uh, lips, butter, eyes. Justin, what, what's the correct answer? I can't. I have this thing about making eye contact. It takes me a while to do that. And I don't check out girls' butts, but I have a thing for lips. The correct answer is lips. Did none of you? And no one said lips. <laughs> Donya, you had that written down first. Go with your first instinct over there. See? Sorry. Well, let's Jeez. move on to the next question. What kind of restaurant do you think JC would take you to? Your options are... Mexican, 
sushi or Italian? Mexican sushi or Italian? <laughs> JC's writing down the correct answer. You guys All got right, it? You guys ready? Sushi. 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 Wow. Are you the sushi kind of guy? This Mexican sushi or Italian? Plain Jane guy, I am. Sushi. You're all a winner. That's the correct answer. Stickers across the board. Oh my. I feel like Vanna White. When was the last time you had sushi, Jesse? Uh, probably about two days ago. Yeah. All right. Everybody got a sticker over here? All right. And we still have a tie with yep. uh, Donnie and Tani. You two both can move on should you stay in the lead. Here's the next question. What kind of music do you think Lance would play set a romantic mood? Ah. Boys to men, Marvin Gaye or D'Angelo? <laughs> Boys to men, Marvin Gaye or D'Angelo? Lance, you write down the correct answer. Boys to Men, Marvin Gaye, D'Angelo, a romantic mood if you're with We're Lance. Ready. Boys to Men. Boys to Men. Boys to Men. Boys to Men. Wow. What's the correct wow. answer, Lance? Wow, 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 Let's wow. get it on. <laughs> Marvin Gaye. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nobody gets a sticker. Lance, what happens? What happens when you put on a little Marvin Gaye? Uh -oh. uh -oh. That's up to me and the data, I guess, huh? Ooh. Marvin Gaye is the correct answer. All right, let's add up the scores. The round is over, and it looks like our two winners are Danya and Tani, everybody. How awesome is that? Congratulations. Congratulations. How do you feel? Good, you look great. You might move on, huh? Make some noise, Big Berlay, for the two finals to start with 100. It's down to them. We'll take a quick break. When we get back, they'll be fighting for a dream day with NSYNC. Not one of them but all of them. And we're gonna get another performance from the guys from their new record, No Strings Attached. Make some noise, Snow Summit, Celebrity Dream Day with the boys of NSYNC rolls on right after this.